Now this mansion in South Tulsa worth just under $3 million. Now if you strike it rich and win that jackpot, you could buy more than 250 of these and still walk away with money left over. That's not all though. It's hard to conceptualize just how much money that is. So we put together a little lesson for you. With each tiny piece of paper, a new possibility. I would definitely get a different house, uh, but I wouldn't go crazy. I have no idea. I would just be, be happy being rich, I guess. But dreaming of a huge amount like $800 million can be more of a challenge. With that much cash, you could build about 108 prayer towers like the one on ORU's campus. You could renovate the Tulsa Library downtown 17 times over. You could build four BOK centers, or you could build the gathering place more than two and a half times over. Math in those terms is pretty fun. Well, I hope you get lucky, you know what I'm saying? But you'll need a lot of luck. The flip side of that math, your odds of winning, 1 in 292 million, meaning you are far more likely of becoming a movie star. And there may be a few other downsides. That's what I've heard too. The people that you don't even know you're related to come out of the woodwork. But neither that nor the daunting statistics in the way are stopping Tolsons from joining in on the craze. Might as well take a shot. If you don't play, you can't win. Now, the previous record was held by a Mega Millions drawing in 2012. That one, $656 million. You could only buy about 218 of these mansions with that. That drawing is tomorrow night. We'll, of course, have those numbers for you on air and online at KJRH.com. In South Tulsa, Stephen Romo, two works for you.